The owner of Skogie's Car Wash says he's reached his breaking point after Skogie's on Underhill Road in Kelowna was targeted Tuesday night. Chris Gogland says he spent tens of thousands of dollars having to repair broken items that have been vandalized and destroyed by homeless people in the area. Every week they try and break into our vacuums. Um, they think there's going to be a wealth of coins in there. In fact, it's mostly tokens that we give out to our customers to use for free vacuum time. Um, and then last night was sort of the final straw. I came in this morning and five of our vacuums have been destroyed. Uh, it's going to cost several thousand dollars to repair and they're going to be out of commission now for at least a couple of weeks while we wait to do this. Skoglin says the site used to be open 24 hours but says it isn't possible now with the heavy crime in the area. The amount of damage and vandalism and theft, it's it's staggering. It's literally tens of thousands of dollars a year right now. So we close up at night, we have security patrols, but nothing seems to work. Skogie says some employees are concerned for their health and safety. Just a couple of months prior, an employee was cleaning up garbage debris surrounding the business and was poked with a needle. Frustration that we feel, and I think all the business uh, owners and community feels, is that what is the city doing? What's, what's being done to to counteract this. It feels like we're just left on our own to fend for ourselves. Um, you know, we pay our property taxes, we try and be good uh, business community citizens, we give back where we can. What is the city doing to stop this? Skoglin says he believes repeat offenders should be left off the street. RCMP have been as helpful as they can be, I feel. Um, they responsive, they come, they watch the video, we fill the reports, they do what they do. Um, but the same people are back on the streets all the time. Castanet has reached out to both the City of Kelowna and RCMP for comment. For Castanet News, I'm Addison Earhart in Kelowna.